a balanced diet and clean surroundings are necessary for good health when in good health our organs function well we feel enthusiastic about our work our physical and mental strength increases malnutrition is often caused by ignorance or misconceptions about food and their nutritive values a malnourished person becomes unhealthy and often falls ill that is why a balanced diet is important for a healthy body a balanced diet includes all food constituents of these the body needs minerals and vitamins in very small quantities however if the body is deprived of those small quantities we can get various diseases deficiency diseases vitamin deficiency every vitamin has a specific and vital function in the body hence the deficiency of each vitamin is related to specific diseases diseases caused by deficiency of vitamin c vitamin c is required for the growth of the body and for our joints bones teeth gums etc this vitamin is soluble in water deficiency of vitamin c causes scurvy it is mainly a children's disease it causes weakness in the baby's limbs the baby has pain and becomes irritable scurvy mostly affects those babies who have not been fed on their mother's milk a nursing mother should include vitamin c in her diet to prevent this disease lemons amla oranges sweet lime and green leafy vegetables are sources of vitamin c fresh fruits and vegetables also contain plenty of vitamin c if baking soda is used while cooking food the vitamin c in it gets destroyed diseases caused by deficiency of vitamin d a deficiency of vitamin d causes rickets in young children the bones of children with rickets remain soft and get bent sunlight falling on the skin causes the formation of vitamin d that is why doctors advise us to take babies out in the sun for some time every day we get vitamin d from animal products like cod liver oil shark liver oil eggs butter and cow's milk vitamin d is needed for the absorption of calcium and phosphorus in our body deficiency of calcium our body has greater need for calcium than for any other mineral a deficiency of calcium makes our bones brittle and causes our teeth to wear away that is why a person having rickets is given a calcium rich diet we get calcium from milk and milk products wheat leafy vegetables cabbage carrots oranges almonds etc growing children and pregnant women are those who need calcium most deficiency of phosphorus like calcium our daily diet must include phosphorus too lack of phosphorus causes loss of weight or stunted growth cereals like wheat bajra corn dals like urad and moong egg yolk milk and leafy vegetables contain phosphorus orange and lemon juice can make up a deficiency of phosphorus deficiency of iron iron is an important constituent of our blood iron gives blood its red color iron helps to supply oxygen to the body iron is necessary for producing red blood corpuscles women need more iron when they are pregnant a deficiency of iron causes anemia an anemic person becomes tired easily that is why we must have an iron rich diet wheat 
jaggery, green leafy vegetables, dates are rich sources of iron. Deficiency of iodine. Iodine is very important for our body. The thyroid gland in our neck secretes a hormone called thyroxine. Iodine is an important constituent of this hormone. Lack of iodine stunts growth. Also, the growth of the thyroid gland becomes irregular. This disorder is called goiter. In several parts of our country, we find people suffering from goiter. People with goiter are advised to use iodized salt. Ill effects of intoxicating substances. We often see people who chew tobacco or smoke cigarettes or BDs or snuff or rub macheri on their teeth. Harmful substances like nicotine, tar and carbon monoxide are formed when a person eats or smokes tobacco. These substances harm not only that person but also those around him. The nicotine in tobacco has damaging effects on the brain and the heart. When you smoke, tar is deposited in the lungs. This can lead to cancer. The gases in tobacco smoke damage the lungs. Smoking has nothing but bad effects on a person's health. People around a person who smokes also have to bear these ill effects. We must all remember that smoking is very bad for health. Chewing tobacco or gutka can cause cancer of the mouth. Many people chew pan or tobacco and spit in public places. This makes the surroundings dirty. Also, germs in the spit can spread diseases. Drinking alcohol or taking drugs like opium, ganja, has harmful effects mainly on the nervous system. Intoxicating substances are addictive. Their effects last only for a few hours. Overuse of such substances can be fatal. Drug abuse is not only harmful for the individual's own health but also for that of society.